let's check it out. Are we there? Are we there? We are indeed. Nice. Hi everyone, this is Chicho. Welcome to my channel and welcome to another live stream. Construction sounds. Today, today is March 27th, 2023 and it's our first patio live stream of the year of 2023 and uh, I figured we'd do uh, the live stream early on this year to a certain degree early on it's still a little cold chilly um, certain parts in my area actually got snow like last couple of days which is weird or last week anyway uh, but I figured I'd show you guys uh, what the patio looks like uh, before we start doing some work here uh, Lark Bark, how are you doing? Hey, hey, you all and Chicho, salutations, salutations. So we're just going to do two live streams uh, in a row today. Uh, we'll shoot this way so you get a feel for what the patio looks like. I'll, I'll step back and show it. And then tomorrow we'll shoot in this direction. Okay. Shino, how are you doing? Long time, long time. Plutonic Pluris. Uh, pivot ca <laughs> uh, comrades, friends and plans indeed. Pri private 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 comrades friends and plans she know how are you chicho i'm doing good she know thank you we're gonna have a little drink today smoke a cigar today first cigar of the year of the season really i went bought the cigars yesterday uh, most likely we'll smoke one tomorrow as well so um but we'll have a cigar today just a break in the new year J Dotty 5252 first time chat Chicho so pumped I finally caught a live stream <laughs> finally I would love to get your opinion on bricks uh, if today is a good day for sure it's open discussion uh, here I'll, I'll I'll do this right now uh, just to let people know anybody watching this on sensor tube if this live stream is less than you know hour 45 minutes two hours or whatever it is that's how long I'm gonna be doing a live stream for we had to cut it because people wanted to talk about things that we're not allowed to talk about on the censored platforms, the technocratic platforms, the one that keep people uh, uninformed or programmed or indoctrinated. So if this live stream is shorter than, let's say, an hour and a half, uh, then the full live stream is going to be available on BitChute, Rumble, and Odyssey because we're going to talk about whatever. This is a uh cigar and uh and check out what i got check out what i got <laughs> i wouldn't pick this up glenn levitt single malt cognac cast selection we're gonna crack this open and uh, drink a little bit neat first and then we'll put it on the rocks and and uh, have a smoke and the cigars uh, we got today we got uh, uh hoyo hoyo de monterey number two uh Commissioner, commissioner selection, and we've got a Sancho Panza Torpedo. This is a Sancho Panza. This is the, uh, not Hoyo de Monterey, um, H. Hoffman Monarch. Uh, not Monarch, H. Hoffman. I went for the H. Hoffman Monarch, but they didn't have it. It's out of stock. I haven't been able to get H. Hoffman Monarchs for years now, right? But H. Hoffman number two. Okay, so it's a lighter cigar. H. Hoffmans are light, so we're going to break the new year with a light smoke, and then we're going to hit the Sancho Panza most likely tomorrow as for the bricks goes uh let me let me get caught up uh j dotty let me get caught up with the with the chat and uh, give people enough time to roll in we'll pour ourselves a drink and uh talk about uh the bricks nations and stuff and see where it's going uh right uh but as far as bricks goes um it's it, it's uh we're going out of a monopolar world uh you know western world western world is collapsing hard like people don't really appreciate what it is i mentioned a few a few months ago i might as well talk about it now a few months ago uh, i was in vancouver with my partner and we're talking about um you know we were with a friend and the friend has italian roots they like traveling to europe and stuff like this i go well uh you know get your traveling in because europe's not looking good it's, it's it's on the verge of collapse uh this was in 2022 right she actually got pissed off at me <laughs> she got pretty angry what do you mean europe is collapsing europe is not collapsing i'm like look i i'm not collapsing europe i didn't do anything <laughs> i'm just giving you the news 
before you hear it from the corporate propaganda, Europe is on the verge of collapse. It's collapsing, right? It's not collapsing. She got really pissed off. <laughs> what do you do? What do you do? <laughs> right? Don't shoot the messenger, man. I didn't do it. They did it. They did it themselves, right? So BRICS is pretty big deal. Pretty pretty soon to bring in Iran, right? Really big deal. Really big deal. Really big deal. Crafter, how are you doing? Hello, hello. Jalen, let's get it. <laughs> how are you friends? Indeed, how are you? hope you're doing well, Jalen. Ghost face, looking like a badass. Am I? Nice. It's a little chilly. I might put on my jacket. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Panic new one, Chicho. Are you familiar with the practice of eating uh, ort ortolans? I don't know what ortolans are. I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> if I knew what they were. <laughs> Plutonic Purse. My first stream on a, a mobile phone. Nice. Hope to have a larger machine again soon. Nice. Nice. Cheryl, how are you doing? Oh, I'll be there in seven years. <laughs> for, for this guy. You want a 20 year old. But this is a, the, the thing with whiskey and um, cognac. Well, whiskey and cognac and spirits that, need, that can, you can age. Once you put them in a bottle, it doesn't matter if it's in a bottle. It's not going to age any more than this. It has to be aging in this casket, right? So this thing's 14 years in the casket, right? Uh, and not casket, in the casket. <laughs> Let's pour our drinks. Oh, yeah, let me do my introduction. We got construction sounds, gang. My apologies. I didn't know they were going to be tearing. Like, they're doing the construction the way they did last year in the same location. Again. <laughs> doing something else it's it's crazy it's the clown world clown world Flutonicles, yes our favorite armenian prep streamer is looking 60s 90s chick today see that how are you doing bricks b-r-i-i-i-c -I -I saudi arabia saudi arabia is not going to join yet uh we'll see if they'll be allowed to join uh I expect Saudi Arabia to have some serious problems, uh, CIA style, right? CIA style. Uh, BRICS, maybe it's new name. If Persia and Saudi Arabia would join, indeed. Iran is in. Iran will join, no matter what. And Iran is crucial to the, the alliance. Uh, Brazil is in deep trouble. Brazil's gone Lula. Brazil's gone woke. Brazil's... Brazil's a WF puppet now, right? So Brazil might be out, right? We'll see. I don't think they'll go out, but they're not going to be as significant. Brazil's in civil war, in my opinion, right? Jalen, you ain't going to be chilling when uh, that whiskey hits, <laughs> brother. Maybe it'll warm me up. It is chilly. I'm going to put on my jacket, I think. Panic, Chicho. I used to be a French... Uh, I used to be a French delicacy before the birds started... Uh, being on the edge of extinction the practice consists of force feeding oh you're talking about the pate uh, bird and then drowned alive in bread whoa wait a second uh, I don't, not, that's, pate. that's not the type of pate I uh, the practice consists of force feeding the bird and then drowned alive in brandy and eating one one bite bones eaten in one bite bones and all people would uh, cover their faces with a cloth before eating them to hide from God due to the inhumane practice is quite an experience I assume it gives you an overwhelming sense of power uh, yeah no I haven't eaten that and I won't eat that no uh, I want <laughs> my philosophy is treat everything with respect with dignity uh, especially not just property not just not just not like especially things that are alive especially when you you have authority power over them that to me sounds like psychopaths uh, in my opinion personally I stopped eating pate in large part because i found out they were force feeding the goose uh geese to get the liver really big i just i just went no so pate that i started buying was uh 
and I haven't bought for a long time is ethical ethical pate. It's hard to come by. Like I haven't bought for years. So no, I wouldn't I would not touch that. That to me I wouldn't even dine at a table when they're doing that, to tell you the truth. Uh, if I knew people that, that were doing that, that were eating that, I'd just say, no, thanks. See ya. Right? Slick make. In a world with so much hate, greed, corruption, tyranny, and acts against liberty, I have a question, and maybe it's not an uh, easy one, but how do you smile and stay happy and calm in today's world? Uh, <laughs> Glenn Levin, <laughs> 14. No, no, I'm just kidding, of course, right? Look, uh, the veil has been lifted. The veil has been lifted, right? Oh, okay, hold on. I'm going to zoom through this. Patreon, Twitch, Twitter, blah, blah. SoundCloud, we're not recording on the Palm mic. Video platforms, join our Gilded server, right? Uh, for those of you supporting this work, gang, thank you for the support. It is, in large part, because of your support that we're able to do what it is that we're doing okay aside from that let's go to the question which is i think is quite important and the question is this how do you smile and stay happy and calm in today's world uh slick mick i don't stay calm all the time and i rip a new a-hole for people who push the party line i've lost a few friends during the last three years well, throughout my life, I've, 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 I've turned around and I've been honest with people and they freak the fuck out, right? I say, too bad, you fragile little shit, right? Like the person that I gave the message to saying, oh, last year, Europe was on the verge of collapse. She got f freaked out on me. I'm like, why are you fucking getting mad at me? I didn't do it. I'm just telling you what's happening. If the Titanic is sinking, I'm not going to tell you everything's well. All is well. All is well. Like in Europe right now, Lagarde, all the leaders, everything's okay. Yeah. Deja vu, people. If you believe in reincarnation, which I personally don't, right? But if you believe in reincarnation, if you've come back to this life and you were alive on the Titanic, right? When it was going down, you'll know that the oligarchs the super rich, the pieces of shit that were running around telling people, everything's wild, people, keep on dancing, play the music, have your drink, while they were hopping onto the fucking lifeboats and sh scooting out, right? If there was a person in the Titanic that was running around telling them, hey, gang, don't listen to these pieces of shit, the Titanic is sinking, and if those people got mad at the person for saying that, fuck them. Simple as that, right? So to answer your question, I'm not happy all the time. Only lunatics, insane people are happy all the time, right? And calm, uh, I'm pretty calm, right, in general. Unless, unless uh, it, it, it is required not to remain calm. Okay, It's seldom now. It used to be a lot more chaotic when I was younger. So age, wisdom, picking my battles... But realizing that all is not well in the world uh, is quite important to know. Be aware, right? Be aware. Let's crack this baby open, gang. Glenn Levitt, 14-year-old, cognac cask selection, single malt. I've never tried this one before. Looking forward to it. Looking forward to it. Where's my knife? Let's go, Void. That's how I eat my chicken wings. That's how I eat my Yeah, you put the whole thing in. Oop, pull it up. Treat everything with respect. Indeed, indeed. Treat everything with respect. And everyone. Right? Unless they're trying to kill you. Then defend yourself. Take that shit from no one. Yeah. Hey, sir, are you drinking? Let's go, Nick. <laughs> yeah, Nick. <laughs> We're going to have some. Oh, it's not a very strong smell. Let's do a little neat action. 
Okay. There. We'll pour it in this one so you can see. Beautiful color to it. Whiskey. Right? Nice. Gang. Salute. Salute. Ooh, that is fine. It's got a cognac kick to it. Very nice. We'll do a little bit more neat as well. And then we'll have a little on the rocks. Let's put this baby back in there. And while the tongue appreciates it, let's light up a smoke. Booze! Platonic plurus. Alcohol is great, but we need other drugs too. <laughs> Uh, imagination enhancers, maybe. I agree with Platonic Panic says there are so many other drugs that are better. Uh, substances, herbs, uh, foods, uh, allies. Drugs is a weird word. I call pharmaceutical drugs. I don't call uh, entheogens drugs. Uh, anything pharmaceutical. I got a cutter here, but I'm not going to use a cutter on this one. Let's see if we'll get a focus on there. There we go. E Chopman, Habana, Cuba, Conosu, number two. And this is, um, it's larger than a Robusto. Robusto is usually about this big. This is larger than a Robusto, and it's larger than a Hoya de Monterey Epicure number two. Uh, I should have looked up the size. I don't think I've smoked this before. So it might be a new cigar that they introduced. Uh, I don't remember A. Chopman Connoisseur number two. Maybe I did, but I didn't uh, smoke it before. Haha, <laughs> Elder God, hope you're doing well. Wet it a little bit. Never share a cigar. I've had people smoking cigars they want to share. I'm like, no, dude, man. I, I suck this thing. Wet this thing. I don't want. Play with it with my tongue. I'm not interested in sharing that. And then push it in to your teeth and then cut. You give it a cut. Okay. And get a little piece out. Just throw that away. You can spit it out. It's fine. Got a torch lighter. Okay. Phenomenal torch lighter. It's old. Sometimes it doesn't pop right away. Hmm. It's not popping right away. Come on. I need to get a fresh one of these. So what I did, I brought out, <laughs> I brought out the regular lighter. There we go. Hey, what's going on? How come this isn't ready? It's on max. Yeah, it should be on max. Uh-oh. I filled it full of butane before I came. Again, I shouldn't have done that. It was working fine before I filled it up. Snip make. Uh, okay, Chicho, thanks for the words. Yeah, Europe is, is a shit show. Uh, I can attest to this as I'm living here. Yeah, Slick Mick, it's, it's, not, it's, it's gonna get worse. It's gonna get worse. Okay. Ness and four. Happy spring, Chicho. Happy spring to you as well, Ness. Nets. Nets and four. Looking forward to more of your patio discussions as the weather warms up. Blessings to you, indeed. Me too. I love. Come on. Hold on, let me check this out. Uh, you can't look at this, <laughs> it'll blow your eyes out. <laughs> hmm. Hold on, let me do 
das tut. Oh, he was working so nicely before. Maybe I should have given the clean actually. The thing that's going on. Uh, Pirate and Pluto. Yeah, picking your battles is definitely a good point. I love spending time with my family, and that's when I'm happiest. But I just need to avoid talking about certain topics with them. Yeah, sometimes you gotta do it. Oh well, we're using regular lighter, unfortunately. We're going ghetto style game. Our torch lighter is not doing well. It could be because it's so cold out here right now. Like really, I need to put my jacket on, I think. We'll see what the whiskey does. Maybe it'll warm us up. This is like sacrilege, lighting it with a regular lighter. Chopman, very light, very light smoke. <sighs> Elder God, but whiskey has no smells. Whiskey has no smell. No, there's a smell to it. It could be because of the cognac uh, cask. Really nice drink. Very nice drink. No notifications went out. Boo, boo. Add three drops of water. I don't have a droplet. <laughs> and then I brought, I brought some water. Is that what you do? You add a little bit of water to open it up, Cheryl? I didn't know that. Maybe that's why I like it on on the rocks. Here, we'll put we'll put ice in there. Okay. I put one ice cube in there. That'll open it up. Right? Sacrilege some people, but I do like a sharp uh, without the ice. Be wiser, reject Pfizer. <laughs> Plutonic Polaris. Hilarious. Hilarious. Um Panic. I don't agree with water in single malt whiskey. I use a touch of water for bourbon, though, because it is usually uh, three to four uh, degrees stronger, really. So, panic, you don't, uh, you only drink whiskey uh, neat, not on the rocks. You don't drink it on the rocks. Very nice. Cheryl to panic. I'm not even talking about a splash. It's amazing what literally a few drops will do. I gotta try it on the next uh, next time I'll get a dropper and go with the ice right now. It's really nice. Really nice. Send fire to Chicho. <laughs> Thanks, Elder God. <laughs> Thank God I brought the other ones. Let's check this out. Is this gonna light? It's not doing it. No, I gotta fix it or buy a new one. Nagushka, how are you doing? No, Chicho, how are you personally maintain a high level of uh, psionic defense while drinking alcohol? I've had a lot of practice. I've had a lot of practice. I don't recommend. Regarding the whiskey, let's keep on reading this conversation between Panic and Cheryl. Yes, I understand. I'm just not on board with it when it comes to single malt whiskey. Really? Okay. Aldega Chicho, is this a sobriety breaking whiskey? Uh, no, I've had some drinks. I, I went to a couple of parties and gatherings and stuff like this. I had some drinks in the last two, three months. But this is the first drink we're having during the live stream. But I did really cut back. I really, really cut back because I kicked it up a, a notch 
um, before this, before cutting back. So once I kick it up to a level where I'm becoming too comfortable with alcohol, I shut it down, right? So I know how to deal with my own vices, I guess, if you want to call it. So once I become too comfortable in a vice, I shut it down, right? And I take a break and then maybe go on waves, just like life. Everything is a cycle. Do not, do not think that everything does this or everything does this or whatever or everything does is really low so if you're really down depressed don't think you're always going to be that right if you're always high very high very high very high don't think it's always going to be that right so i follow a wave i'm i believe in cyclic nature of life and i try to behave accordingly right panic no all whiskey has smell and it should have it's best vodka that shouldn't have a smell yeah yeah some of the best very minute smell it, it, the smell of vodka should come out when you're drinking it right and when it's frozen when you, when you bring like I store my vodka in the freezer vodka you're when you're drinking comes out of the freezer whiskey not whiskey unless I'm totally mistaken but whiskey uh, on the rocks is good uh, neat is good uh, in coffee hot tea coffee is good cognac straight up uh, neat uh, neat you don't I don't put cognac on the rocks uh, and cognac with tea and uh, coffee is absolutely amazing and just heat it up a little bit is phenomenal right And the beauty of it is when you get a little bit of ice melting in there, maybe this is what Cheryl's talking about. You can see the sort of uh, wave of the two liquids sort of mixing. I think that's what it is anyway. I haven't looked at the science of it. Plutonic Pluris. Did the Irish bring whiskey to Scotland or the other way around? Good question. I think the Scots would say Scot Scotland brought it to Ireland and the Irish and the Irish would say Irish brought it to Scotland. Vagabond Maximus. Yeah. It brings out the flavors. It does. Cool, cool, cool. Shino. Chicho, do you think the US will enter um, a recession soon? I think we're already in a recession. It it was already a recession before they decided that the definition didn't apply anymore. Right? There was two quarters of negative right I'm gonna put on my jacket let me show you guys the patio let me show you guys the patio check this out okay so we get a good look on it before it's all built up again right wire that I'm gonna do some work around here again close up some stuff and build up some other things chicken wire this type of chicken wire I think this is one inch really comes in handy okay uh, I use a lot of this I'm gonna to support the grapes uh, that you see on top here the canopy I'm gonna go get some wood and put a post up okay tie it to this okay. that's solid right and then have a, a two by four maybe not two by four is too big two by two or something like this going across and then tie it to the uh, to the wall here okay that way it gives support to the grapes the grapes have reached a level where uh, they're getting heavy so the rope is not going to be enough because I have it for three years now. I've had it just connected to the wall with rope and it was given a fair bit of grapes. So I'm gonna have to fortify it a little bit. Okay, we have some chard in the planter over there. We've got some Here's some parsley from last year 
that survived the winter. So we're gonna grow this. We're probably gonna grow more parsley. Italian parsley that made it, okay, through the winter. And then we got in the planters we got some chard that made it through, some uh, chives that made it through and stuff. We got another planter here, okay. So that's the look of the patio right now. Uh, before I start working in it, okay. This is a great smoke. This is a really nice smoke. It's getting stronger. As you smoke a cigar, it'll get stronger. Okay. So at the beginning, it may seem a little light. Uh, H. Hopman does. Boulevard's rare that they feel light at the first smoke. Okay. Very nice smoke. Let's try the torch lighter again. Not doing it. I think in general the Western world is going into a recession. Period. Um, big time recession. Period. And that's why they're trying to kick it up into a war-based economy because they think that's going to bring it out of recession. Now I don't know about you guys. I don't want to go to a war-based economy. So we need to get rid of these world economic forum puppets vote them out if you can oh. nice very nice elder got to panic I have done the Scottish Highlands tour many of the best were silent um, in smell, but godlike in taste, really. Uh, Elder God, same, same as uh, Michicho. I wasn't server, sir, 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 when I read it, uh, sir, sober, sober, uh, between 1994 and 2007. Um, yeah, I, I'm older than you. So there was periods, uh, yeah, it's just, it is what it is. Do not recommend. Do not recommend. A party chicho would be interesting to experience. I'm a, I'm, I'm a, uh, like when I used to play drums, people liked to play drums with me because it was a fun drum player. I kept my beats and it was just fun. Um, I'm a fun partier. Family Chicho, yes, I only drink it neat. Even one cube of ice dilutes a lot, so I would rather just chill, chill it a bit in a fridge. However, ice can work well if the ice cube is very big because it melts very slowly. Yeah, I usually in general use uh, big ice cubes, right? Ah, very nice beautiful beautiful drink April 1st in Canada alcohol prices kick up because of taxes so government has been spending money like mad right like basically future generations and my generation as well we're we're fucked right <laughs> in terms of government right so uh, they're kicking up taxes on everything Right, they're kicking up, kicking up taxes on everything, gas, alcohol. I talk to, uh, I have, I know people that smoke cigarettes. Cigarettes right now, a pack in Canada is, they're all like the people I know. They're buying it from the reservation. They're buying it from uh, the indigenous, right? Because it's too expensive. 
uh, local places to buy, but a lot of people don't have those hookups, right? So I think it's 18 bucks a pack now or something like this, or 20 bucks a pack. It's crazy, right? Bunch of criminals in, in, uh, that are ruling over us, eh? The Scots are often uh, credited with the invention of whiskey, and there is some evidence to support this claim. In 1494, a Scottish friar named John Carr was granted a patent for a process of distilling spirits. This process was later refined by another Scots, Scottish clergyman, Robert Boyle, in the early 1600s thank you very much elder god for the scottish uh for the history lesson uh so scotland would be it <laughs> Nagushka comes in right after <laughs> irish for sure <laughs> hilarious wars have been started because of this dispute i think maybe going through the uh, going through england <laughs> across the sea or maybe no, up top. Wales is the bottom. We keep on confusing. I have an unopened bottle of Glen Fedich 21. Definitely the most expensive a bottle I've ever owned. Haven't opened it yet. I have it for over for you. Nice, nice. This stuff is getting crazy expensive, gang. Crazy expensive. I'm going to dump the ice. We're going to go neat. I'm, I'm gonna leave I'm gonna do this that way we get a little bit of water in there as Cheryl says right and then we're gonna pour the whiskey in there with a little bit of water right so we're gonna get rid of the ice in another glass I have so I got a little bit of water in there right where is it there's a little bit in there you can see right sure, that's water for us. Should have made this a five hour stream. <laughs> Game Nice Smoke Salutations. Salutations to our loved ones. Salutations to those who can't be with us. Salutations for those who might be on their way uh, out from our existence, from our reality. Okay. Salutations to you. Salutations to freedom. We're drinking this neat. We're drinking this neat. We might even smoke two cigars today. No, maybe. Who knows? We'll see. Plutonic pillars. So 15th century is the first officially recognized date for whiskey. According to Elder God, the history. Wow, there's a fair bit of chat. Gang, I'm going to scroll down. And before we do, before we do, let's do our public service announcement for humanity. Free Assange, Free Assange, Free Assange. Julian Assange, the publisher and journalist that has been crucified for trying to bring transparency and accountability of capital as power to humanity. Something that me and you desperately need in our societies. For more information, see wikileaks.org, defend.wikileaks.org, or countless resources available online. Salute to Julian Assange. Huge, huge respect. Cheryl, partially survived, even with a crap winter ours all died really yours all died ours no we put the we put it against the wall of the house so maybe a little bit warmer um yeah it survived i was surprised i was surprised i was surprised i'm scrolling down gang i'm scrolling down cheryl now our on ice hot hyssops high sop is starting to come up already so it's a wash nice 
gaming goods you grown of that uh, any of the doubles lettuce this year autos or just uh, feminized seeds oh, we're definitely growing again this year we grow we've been we're gonna grow every year we're gonna grow every year we got to get the seeds we got to we got we haven't started them yet it, we should be starting them now so uh, my partner does the, the the starting so I'm gonna hop on it uh, get her to hop on it and do the seeds um, and we're gonna we're gonna do for sure we're gonna do for sure and for the record devil's weed I guess it's called cannabis I call it angels blessing I guess <laughs> I just came up with that but it's cannabis I call it cannabis and we're gonna grow cannabis indeed indeed and maybe tobacco I should be starting the tobacco seeds as well oh we lost the ash that was a good smoke rank how are you doing hello chicho how are you always nice to catch your live stream sometimes it's hard because of europe time zone for me recently fell in love with rum nice or rather cube cubla libre i've drank so much cubla libre in my life uh, cola plus rum plus lime uh, the variety is amazing a example jamaican rum with uh our more fruity while rums from barbados tend to have a higher uh, sucrose content that results in a caramel richness you can get good stuff for 20 30 euros uh, per liter here in germany nice nice for me i drank I've, i've drank when i was younger a lot of jamaican some not barbados but i drank a lot of jamaican some maybe uh, jamaican mainly uh, but as i got older i almost exclusively only drank uh, Cuban uh, rum and Cuban rum is phenomenal phenomenal uh, and I love rum uh, I love rum but I stopped drinking rum because of the sugar content and uh, rum can be rum can be messy just like whiskey it can be wet messy uh, but the danger with rum uh, versus whiskey is this whiskey if you drink high-end whiskey you're drinking it neat or on the rocks right so you know what you're drinking with rum the problem is you do a lot of mixes unless you're drinking uh, high high-end rum where you do neat or on the rocks right like whiskey so the low end not not even low end like mid-grade rums really good rums actually when you start using them as mix you're not really 100 sure how much you're drinking and i make my drinks heavy uh, when i do make them so it can get quite dangerous quite dangerous salute can we still load this on sensor tube are we still okay to load this on sensor tube or should we kill it right now for sensor tube and say gang if you're watching this live stream on sensor tube full stream will be on bit you rumble with odyssey we'll see let's see what else is coming up we're not in we're not in a censored world yet all right panic chicho i remember some family friends putting like uh five six ice cubes in like 10 milliliters of whiskey the color was close to white literally the only thing i could taste was water and rubbing alcohol now that's a hilarious hilarious every now and then if you need a little hit why not you don't want it to be too heavy but man it can't like yes and this and open conversation you can't mess that up <sighs> lark bark chicho do you think they're ever get rid of justin trudeau yeah for sure trudeau's on his way out man. there's a lot of people in canada that are fucking fuming man really there's there's a lot of brainwashed okay gang if you're watching this on sensor tube i'm sorry uh, what what time is it 40 how long been it 45 minutes in 45 minutes in we're done 
full live stream bitchu rumble nasi in the description of this video okay uh thank you for being here <laughs> If you want your conversation censored, you're done. You can join us. If you don't want to censor, you can join us and kill it. <laughs> right? Aside from that, we're going back to the whiskey and the cigars and an open conversation. Uh, yeah, Justin Trudeau's fucked.